gentlemen, our next fight of the evening is scheduled for three three-minute rounds, all for the Tough Enough Women's Strongweight Championship. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, undefeated with five wins. She is the current number one ranked fighter in Utah and current Utah amateur champion, fighting out of Hidden Valley, MMA, Chihuahua, Mexico, Brenda. Her opponent stands across the cage in the red corner with three wins and then four losses. Fighting out of Extreme Couture, Las Vegas, Nevada. <laughs> Emily Whitmire! <laughs> the referee charge of the action inside the cage is Mark Smith. So Brenda Enriquez in the orange kit there. Obviously fighting with a heavy heart after the loss of her brother, but she has been an incredible fighter thus far in her amateur career. Meanwhile, the, the reborn Emily Whitmire, the revamped Emily Whitmire, she uh, enjoys a little bit of a height advantage, as you can see there. She's in the black and the green trim. Women's strawweight title on the line. Here we go. Tommy opens up with some jabs and a, a nice hook. Good takedown. Bring the scramble, she's trying to scramble back up. Enriquez trying to grab the neck there. You see Whitmire doing a good job of sliding out to the opposite side to relieve the pressure. Very tough to finish a choke when your opponent's on the other side of your body like that, and Whitmire does pop her head out. <laughs> Again, three three-minute rounds at the championship level. Whitmire in the half guard. Good top control. Brenda's kind of holding on. Let's see if she looks for an underhook or tries to hip escape to get back to her feet. Yeah, stuffed against the fence a little bit for sure. I guess trying to crawl back to her feet. Woodmire with a lot of pressure. Short left hands in there. Yeah, Woodmire got to press up against Cage pretty well. Good control. And Brenda staying composed, looking for underhooks. Trip. Fantastic. Right into side control. Danny, you said it. I mean, what she's showing so far, not indicative of her three and four record, that's for sure. I mean, she is looking fantastic thus far. Is Emily Whitmire. Whitmire, good control from the top. Landed some good ground and pound. Frustrating and recast a little bit. Bit of a crucifix position there. Yeah. Pinning things down with her knee. Punching away. Referee Mark Smith saying want to see some action. Keeping a close eye. Got to get out of that. Whitmire doing a fantastic job of just pounding away from this crucifix. Brennan Enriquez trying to buck out. That's what Mark Smith wants to see, moving those hips. You can't stay flat on the mat. This is not going to be good for Enriquez. She's close. got to work out of here. Just short punches here, but they're adding up. Yeah, Whitmire really doing a lot of damage from the top. Now she's really trapped in that, that left arm, the crucifix, and that's it. And that's the call. Emily wow. Whitmire, your new tough enough. Women's strawweight champion. And look at the emotion. Amazing. Absolutely incredible. Downing the previously undefeated, the highly touted Brenda Enriquez. Emily Whitmire composed, got the fight to the floor, set up in that crucifix position and just pounded away as we watch the replay. What an yeah. emotional moment for her. Yes, good takedowns. He's good, good top control, really controlled Enriquez. Um, kind of outgrappled her, you know, Enriquez was doing her best trying to get back up, but really just couldn't get back to her feet. And Whitmire really dominated, landed some good shots here in the clinch. Nice outside trip. Landed on the side control. And eventually ended up here in this uh, somewhat, of, like I said, a crucifix position and just let the hammer fist and the short punches rain down until Enriquez was just overwhelmed, couldn't do nothing. And there you go, referee Mark Smith stopped the fight. Wow, just what an incredible position uh, in Lee Whitmire. Uh, Incredible performance, just showing the improvement that she's made oh, yes. since those opening losses in her career. Your heart goes out to Brenda Enriquez fighting after the loss of her brother, suffering her first beat. Let's get the time of the stoppage. Presenting the Tough Enough Women's Strawweight Championship belt is John from AA Printing. After two minutes, eight seconds into the first round, your winner by TKO and new Tough Enough Women's World Amateur.
Amateur Strawweight Champion, Emily Whitmire. Standing here in the cage with the winner, Emily. I know the story, but does everyone here know the story? I don't think so. I've wanted this belt since I first started fighting, and I lost a few fights. I never thought I'd get it, but I freaking got it! Ah! <laughs> you should have kept the mouthpiece in. Sorry about that. How great does it feel to win in Las Vegas? So freaking amazing. I love this town. Moving here was like the best decision I ever made. I want to thank Dennis. That's his fucking move. He does that and like showed me it's amazing. Thank you, Jamie, Misha, all my training partners, all my sponsors. I, I'm just so happy. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, your new women's world strawweight amateur champion, 